Hello crew, welcome back to the Gaming Ocean TCG channel. And in this video, we have a Pokemon product we're gonna unbox. I know it's been a bit since we opened up something Pokemon related. We had some Digimon videos, the new Grand Archive TCG, good stuff. Now back to some Pokemon. And this is actually Crown Zen, the product, the More Pico V Union Premium Playmat Collection Box. I've eyed this for a bit. Um, this has been out for a few weeks. I think it came out in April. 2023 just to note um pretty cool because from the title of the box it looks like it comes with a play map that's a plus for me of course we're going to flip the box over and kind of read exactly what comes in it looks like you get some booster packs and the more pico union cards i think correct me if i'm wrong you can actually use these in the card game um i don't know how it gets put together i don't know if it's like in Yu Gi Oh, like exodia put the pieces put them together make a card um but each card actually has a move or an ability to it. This one has Union Gain. This one's All You Can Eat. First rule down here, and Electro Ball. And of course, it looks like we had a promo full art card put together of these four cards. Um, yeah, cool stuff. Um, can't wait. I want to open it up and see what we can get, especially some Crown Zenith packs. They have some really pretty cards in this set right here. So hopefully one day I get a full set of almost one of each card. Uh, let me flip it over here. Let's see what actually come. What else comes in the box, right? Uh, four edge promo cards that make up a single more Pico V Union, okay, which is the four cards we saw. An oversized card featuring the more Pico V Union, which is the giant promo card, all put together, right? One helpful supporter card featuring Professor Burnett. Okay, the playmat. Yes, there is a playmat. Cool. Playmat featuring the Marnie and more Pico five TCG booster packs from Crown Zenith, and of course a. Pokemon TCG live card code. So, very excited to open this up. Can't wait. So, let's just dive in. Let's check these uh, union cards up close and what we can pull from these packs. And of course, this, let's just tear it apart on the side because it never wants to actually open up correctly. All right. Oh, oh, I was wondering what caught on the bottom here. It looks like the playmat, I guess. Oh, the playmat was just hidden underneath it all. Playmats. Let's check it out. I want to check this out first. I like playmats. Oh, not going to lie. This is a sick playmat. I like it. This is really nice. Got the Crown Zenith logo. The bottom here got Marnie More Pico. This is a very nice playmat. The Rating Eevee playmat was nice, and this is super cool. And we got the, like, right here, the electricity. Night Town. Let's say it was a night, you know, they're in town at night. There's a Pokemon Center here, I guess. They're in an alleyway. This is sick. I like this playmat. I'm probably going to use this playmat. I'm going to go and play Digimon. Sweet. I, I like this playmat. I'm just going to keep saying that. Put it to the side. Let's keep moving forward here. That's a nice play, man. I need to stop. All right, so the first plastic piece holds a Union card. So let's look, flip it over. Oh, pulls up all four. Nice. Oh, well, here's the Professor Burnett card. So let's just kind of let the cards fall like that. Maybe not the best way to do it. Okay. Oh, look at that. Look how they ship that. If the camera want to focus, look at that. Damage to the card on the edges. Which one is this one? The Professor Burnett. Okay. Well, it's not a total big loss, right? But Professor Burnett, search your deck for up to two cards in this card and then shuffle your deck. Well, you can search anything. You may play one support, support a card during your turn. So search your deck up to for up to two cards in, in this card zone. So search the two cards and put them... I don't know the, the mechanics and how it works when it comes to the deck profiles for Pokemon, but okay. Pretty much just like like a Foolish Burial, just send two cards, or send a card to the graver. But this is two. You search for them and put them to the graver. TCG Live card. Just looking at the edges to make sure this didn't also come damaged. And here is the Union cards themselves. 
You just look at the back of them. Make sure they're not damaged either. They look in good shape. It's just the Professor Burnett came. I don't know what it was. Here's the, the right leg of Exodia. Now, this is the right corner card, right lower corner. Electric ball. So has it literally it has a move, right? Uh, when your opponent V Union is knocked out, your opponent takes three prize cards. Whoa. What's on the side? I don't know how V Unions actually work in the card game. How to play V Union? Oh, maybe you'll tell us here. Once per game during your turn, combine four different more Pico V Union from your discard pile and put them onto your bench. Oh, well, that makes sense why the search card says take two and discard them. Okay. Makes sense. Now I understand. So literally, once you have them on your discard or your trash, you just play the whole thing? Let me see. Is that what it says in all of them? Yeah, that's exactly what it says in all of them. This has burst wheel. V and Union rule. Oh, when you put them together. That's a play V and Union. This has Union gain. Attached to energy. From your discard pile. It's like a discard pile deck. All you can eat. Draw cards until you have 10 cards in your hand. Well, that's awesome. This is kind of cool. Well, here's the Union cards. And of course, I'm going to put them down here. The promo giant card. So this is what it looks like when they're all put together. Very nice. All right, we've got the packs. You know what we can do, actually? So I'm going to let me throw these to the side over here. Make some space. I'm going to lay down the mat. Just because I really like the playmat, and I'm just going to keep saying that. This is where it's going to be done. Do something a little different here. Boom. This is the new view for the video. Okay. Got the promo card over here. Professor Burnett. I'll just kind of space them out also. Yeah, look good. All right. So it's going to look like for the rest of the video. Sweet. All right. I like this play, man. Anyways, five booster packs. Let's see what luck we have. And if we, you know, I've never pulled a gold card at this set, so maybe I can pull a gold card this time. I don't know. I hope so. Oh, this is nice and easy. All right, let's go. Perfect. Give us some luck. I think it's three, right? Usually. I know with the new set, I think it's just put the one behind it because you get two reverse foils now. All right, first card we got here is a Bisharp. Oh, it's cool. Like that. Graveler. Pokemon Catcher. Shinx. Corfish. Ponyard. Seal. Rockruff. Ooh, I don't think I have this one. Nessa. That's the best gym leader. Signed. What does this do actually? Put up to four in any combination of water Pokemon and water energy cards from your discard pile onto your hand. Cool. Behind Nessa, Tangrowth and the Fire Energy Soul 4. Sorry. Out of touch. So nothing behind this. Nothing foil wise. But we got the Nessa. That's actually new to me. So to me, it's a plus. Hopefully, y'all can see that. Let me just. Move it down here a bit. Move the Nessa there. All right, next pack. Eventually, next pack. There we go. One, two, three, four. There we go. All right, of course. Start with the energy, right? Got the fighting energy, trekking shoes, Lunatone, Soul Rock, Truby, Execute. Look at how worried this guy is. Energy Retrieval, Emolga, Love Disc, and Reverse Foil, Tapu Lele. What Pokemon is this from? Is this from the Sun and Moon stuff era? Looks like it. Sounds like one. But this looks like I like the artwork. Real pretty. The art style is nice. What's behind this one? We get Glaceon V. All right. I think this is actually my second Glaceon V. I'm not going to lie. Very nice. Hey, Evolutions. Always nice to get. 
All right, let's put this to the side right there. Some space. Three more packs. All right, does not want to open up that way. Let's open up from the top. Of course, the Aaron. There we go. Got the Thunder Energy. Salazzle. This is cool art. It's really cool, Salazzle. Dusclopski. Mitang. Aaron. Riolu. Starly. Scyther. Pokeball. And Ditto. <laughs> Here's the Ditto. You can tell by the goofy face. Okay, look. This is actually a new card to me. This is a Galarian card, right? Galarian art card. I'm going to call it a gallery card. Illustration card. Um, nice. We pulled one of these. Ditto. I'm not going to lie. I miss the yellow borders on a new set, on a Pokemon uh, Scarlet and Violet. I like them. I like the yellow borders better. Um, cool. How does Ditto work in this game? Sudden transformation. This Pokemon can use the attack of any basic Pokemon in your discard pile. Oh. Except for the Pokemon with a rule box, Pokemon B, Pokemon GX, etc. have rule boxes. You still need the necessary energy to use each attack. So pretty much just copy something in your discard pile. This is nice. I like. I kind of like that. Look at that. Look at Goofy's face. Ditto face. Bind Ditto. Red Gigas. V-Star. Nice. I don't think I actually have this one. I pulled a Red Gigas illustration gallery card. For sure from this set. Sweet. Well, here's a V-Star. Nice. Okay, this pack was a winner. Um, let's just leave it like that. Two more to go. Still have yet to ever pull a gold card, but that's okay. Maybe one day. Alright. Let's go. Got the green energy. Krokorok. It's actually pretty cool. Looks at you. Oh, cute. Snuggling with. Oh, it's a Pokemon. Or is it a stuffed animal version of it? Prince and Hisui. Chatot. Nice. Yanma. Ponyard. And these arts always get me. Just like a clay or just a toy version of them. Cricketot. Shinx. And. Oh, sick. Leafeon V Star. This is super new to me. I tell you, man, Pokemon, the Crown's Dance set has. Beautiful cards. I'm not gonna lie. It's actually a beautiful set. This is beautiful. Beefy on V Star. Now this is a hit to me. Beautiful, nice. Look at that. <laughs> Look at its tail. It's in the in the water jar, like watering itself. Beautiful. And another hop. I've got a bunch of these hops. A hit here. What's the last one going to give us? Please give me a gold card. That'll even top off everything we pulled off, honestly. The first two packs are meh. The next two packs are great. This last pack, come on. Come on. End it with something big. Let's end it with something big. Here we go. Energy card. Energy switch. Kokorok. Lunatone. Young Goose. Cherubi. Execute. Energy retrieval. Emolga. Okay, reverse flow. Double O. Is it racing the boulders? Oh, what's going on? We're rolling dash. Maybe it's just rolling around with the boulders. This is actually cool. And... Oh, man. Well, full Corona. Not even foil. Well, I mean, two out of five. Not so bad. I mean, if you include the Glaceon, three out of five. But these, I mean, this plus the illustration. These V-Stars, very nice. Very nice. All right. That's going to wrap it up for this video. Um, very nice. Very nice product, only because, of course, the playmat is very nice. I like the playmat. It's very cool. Um, in Crowns in the products, Crowns in the booster packs, the set has amazing, beautiful artwork to the illustration cards and the special cards you get. Even these V-Star cards look great. I mean, look at this Leafeon. It's amazing. But this is what you get out of the More Pico V Union um, Playmat Collection box. Um, I say it's worth it. It is worth it. Um, 
especially i mean usually when products come with playmats i think they are worth it um and it's also worth it because it is a crowns and the product very solid set in my personal opinion um but what do you all think think this is a is part this uh, product is worth it do y'all do y'all enjoy the crowns in a set do y'all look like the new scarlet and violet set do you enjoy or miss the yellow borders on the new sets um so let me know down in the comments below and that'll wrap it up for this video um stay tuned there will be some more um pokemon videos and coming um as well as my videos on the grand archive structure decks there'll be three parts one for each structure deck and eventually i'll get to the battle saga video uh, once i figure out how you play the card game so i can at least give an explanation how it works and how what the cards do and whatnot and i can understand or else we can just wing it and just open it up and you know reaction right um but yeah if y'all enjoyed if i made it through i appreciate it thank you very much please like and subscribe support the channel join the crew for more tcg content and opening and until next time smooth sailing